process we're looking at here is we are taking the door that's been just assembled and putting it on our CNC router. The CNC router, as you can tell, has probably, in the, uh, a tool changer, has roughly 15 to 20 different tools. What that does is allows us to do many different machining items without ever moving the door. What you're gonna see today is see us sizing the door, beveling the door, hinging the door, not sure if we're boring it, but we can do all that kind of machining without moving the door once. This machine even has the ability to do, a, the one head can do a five axes, which means we can do the X, Y, and tilt the Z. The first step, as I mentioned, is the door is gonna be sized. So we're gonna size it to width. This is done with a simple router going around and making sure the door is sized accurately and square. The next step after it's been sized is to bevel the door. What we're doing right now is putting, if it's a, putting a approximately two degree bevel on the edge of the door. Our next step is to route out for the hinge pocket. As you can see with the CNC capability, we can program it so that the machining is done, eliminating the amount of tear out that would normally take place if you were just holding a router and going around. One of the steps you see with this router bit is the two side ones are blowing air to make sure it's clean where the machining's being done. That's key so you don't have any wood chips or anything else taking away from the clean machining. We are machining it to have uh, the sweep put on the bottom. A simple thing like not machining all the way to end so you don't have blowout and going back in. Uh, the last step going involved is a as we're drilling for the, the hinge screws. As you can see, it's on a horizontal aggregate, so the screw will always be perfectly straight. The overall benefit of a machine like this is to take the expert craftsman that we have with building all the different unique parts of the door, but utilizing the investment in technology to have the accuracy and consistencies in tolerances and machining. One of the latest things that we've done is to utilize technology to communicate between our office and shop. We have installed roughly 30 tablets on the shop floor to allow us to communicate quickly and effectively between the office and shop. These tablets allow us to take the 15 or so copies we'd put on the shop floor and have it so we weren't using all the paper, but additionally, any time a change needs to be made to allow us to make that change quickly, effectively, and be communicated throughout the whole shop. Everything that you see when you sign up a drawing, to the drawings, to the cutlass, is available with a couple clicks away to see the finite details that you have proven your drawings right to our shop for.